Hi everyone, I went to a crafty garage sale today and I got some uh, good deal items. And first, this is a Seven Gypsies uh, self inking stamp. And I thought it was funny because it says viewer discretion advised. And when you stamp it, you get, you know, what that looks like. <laughs> and it was 75 cents. And then I got this bag. It's mostly some glue dots and some foam uh, pop-up dots. And it came with also this uh, glue was in there too. And there's a little bit left. But this is one of those refillable ones. And I like the pink one. So I, I got that. But that those all came together. And it was a dollar. I don't know why that one was in there. And it's marked 50. But doesn't matter <laughs> and then I got this Fisker rotary trimmer cutter and uh, these are my favorite uh, rotary cutters and you never have too many of these and this was uh, 75 cents and then I got some Fisker's uh, spring-loaded uh, scissors and these were a dollar so I got those and then I got this stamp. It's a library card stamp, but it was on this block. But this is a brand new block still in the cellophane. So this was a dollar. And here's a rotary blade. It was a quarter. And then this Heidi Swap mini iron because I iron a lot of my projects. So it'll be nice not to have to get out the big iron, and that was a dollar. But like when I watercolor and my watercoloring gets all, you know, bumpy or wavy, I actually iron it. And I do that between two pieces of paper. And then I got this uh, Fisker uh, crimper. It was a dollar. Then I got all these, there was uh, lots of ink, but they were older Stampin' Up, you know, the old style Stampin' Up ink pads. I didn't get any of those, but I got all the kaleidoscope inks that she had. And they're nice and juicy. And they were 50 cents each. So that was a good deal. And she had some stamp sets, but some of them I already had. But, and they were older Stampin' Up! stamp sets. And some of them I thought she had priced too high. So I didn't, I only got one stamp set and it was $3.00. And it's called uh, Positively Perfect, but I had to get it because it's a kitty, and it is an older style Stampin' Up! set, but that's okay. It's got a kitty. <laughs> and then I got the Stampin' Up! chalk, and I love working with chalk. And I already have like a one, two, three. This will be my fourth uh, set of chalk, <laughs> but for a buck, you know, can't beat that. And the only thing wrong with it is one of these brown ones is broken, but that's okay for a buck. I don't care. And this is really hard to open. I really got to work at it. I can't even get it open on camera. So it's kind of a pain in the butt to open, but that's okay. But you can never have enough chalk. And I got these. It's uh, to hold a uh, 12 by 12 paper. I got one. There's a divider in that one. Two. Three. And. This one is four. And these are 50 cents each. And this one has a bunch of like divider thingies in it. So. Yeah, so I thought I could put my, some of my 12 by 12 papers in there. And then the last item I got was this purple cow trimmer. And um, it's a guillotine trimmer. And a rotary trimmer. And then it's got two other blades. Up there is a um, like scallop blade. And then down there is, um, a, not a score, oh, what is this, dots, would you call those, I'm not, perforated, I don't know, 
but it works. And this does uh, detach. You can take the rotary, you know, part off and just have a guillotine cutter or you can just have a rotary cutter. And then once you take this off, there's actually an arm that'll swing out. So that, and that was $4. So that is my crafty garage sale finds. And she had lots and lots of paper, but I didn't get any paper. Um, but I did pretty good. I didn't want to spend too much, so... But that is my garage sale find, so thanks for watching. Bye.